This is the Bigfoot from K2. It's a universal mount specifically designed for a three inch E-curve. They did a step down right here. So when you're driving your lags, you have, you have room trying to like drive a, a lag and then putting it in sideways or something. That spacer clips on and all it does is set the distance. They don't include a lag screw or a T-bolt with it because the whole idea with this product is to make it universal. They wanna make it so that um, you can take this mount, you can get a, a three inch curb kit from Chemlink, you can get the Bigfoot from K2 and then order whatever saddle or T-bolt or whatever you need for that application and install it with any product. And that's something that I love. I hate how many different manufacturers are out there making a slight rip off or variation of someone else's product that is just altered enough to not be compatible. Like people who are put it, pushing products that are universal and work with other brands, I, I absolutely love that because as an industry, I wanna see us work together, make kick-ass solar panel installations and like do a good job. Like, like that. yeah, so that that's badass. A few different tips for these. Um, you may want to put your rails on before you pour. One thing I've seen happen is these big foots are a little bit tilted and then you put the rail on it and it bends them in as you're going to create like a gap for water to go straight down um, into the hole you drilled. You know, these need to be really straight and it might make sense to put on your attachments before you pour that. You do wanna fill it all the way up, almost so it's overflowing. It kind of seemed messy when I was doing it, but overflowing is better than having it too low and creating like an area for water to just kind of pool up. This is an initial review of this product. I thought it was a really cool universal product that would accent the market and allow us to install more panels on more homes for a better price. So I'm giving my thumbs up on this. Like I mentioned, you can go to your local supply company, request a curb kit, an e-curb kit, get the three inch, and then ask for the Bigfoot um, from K2. And then also remember, you need to order lag screws and your T-bolts, depending on what type of attachment system you're using. Um, you're gonna want a different size bolt um, dependent on what the surface is, how thick the foam is, um, what type of tilt kit you're doing. So all of that's going to come down to what your engineering is on, on that specific project. But thanks for watching the video. Subscribe and check out my other videos. Dude, this thing just seems so epic.